15 laps of tyre saving action brought to you by McLaren. I am contemplating using traction control for the last part of the race to just TC1 as the tyres really start to get nailed. I saw a, a really fast guy do it um, and it was to good effect so Got pushed out by Mr. George. Thought that the BMW would get the jump and it did. Just getting caught on the outside here by these cars. Just losing touch a little bit with these guys. Just don't want to be putting too much steering input into the car, really. That's the way to save the tyres, really. Got Lopez in front, just uh, scraping the wall. Oh, we are slow. 0.5 second penalty. Nice toe down the back straight here. Right, we're finding a groove now. Genesis is fast in a uh, straight line, so we have to make them go around the outside. Just sliding the car a bit now. He's just sticking with us now. Just dropped him a tiny bit there. Just not quite up to the pace that we need to be for, for the race, to be honest. But the tyres aren't looking too bad. Let's go, let's go. Losing time to the guys in front. Could have been on the throttle a bit earlier. Genesis is pulling back point two just from... better pace. A little bit late on the brakes there. Any more of those and we'll kill the tyres, that's for sure. Lap number 6, 45-1. Ah, got to change gear early enough we lost a little bit of our advantage. Cost us 0.1. Rookie mistake. Oh, penalty. For Julian. 0.7 slower is not good. Try and get the toe down the back straight rather than just try and do a dive bomb on the very first corner. Um. 
don't understand why I'm losing so much time all of a sudden. Don't know whether I got a little push there or not. That number nine tyres aren't looking too bad. Back left definitely taking a bit of a hammering. Starting to catch the guys in front a little bit. Doing okay and taking some time out of that Genesis, almost a second in one lap, so that's good. Yeah, they're definitely fighting up there, and then this guy at the front here keeps hitting the wall and messing about, so doing okay so far. So this setup is supposed to be this way, really. I mean, at the end of the day, it's supposed to save the tyres. He's just struggling on that last turn. Getting a bit of a slipstream now. It's a shame sixth gear doesn't really work in this car. <laughs> this guy's not going to give up third easily. If there's other people watching, uh, go and join McNaughty's League and make it a really awesome competition with loads of people. Yeah, I thought that might happen. Just the um, lack of downforce on the cars now starting to affect me. Well, he gets a slight reprieve from me. I have to try and catch him up again. So the tyres are just starting to go on me, becoming a little bit more unpredictable and certainly underneath brakes. So. Uh, sorry, underneath the wing. So, what I'm going to do is disastrous for people. Turn it on to TC1. Try to save the last little bit of a tyre that we've got. I saw one of the fastest guys around do it on dead tyres, so... If he does it, why wouldn't I? Especially because they're being a bit unpredictable at the moment. push into the fence there. We're up into P2 just like that. Here we go. Just got to hold on now. Crikey. <laughs> hold on. Taking time out of the leader, but not enough. Well, our setup's definitely looked after the tyre pretty nicely, given a McLaren. It's definitely getting sketchy through the bus stop. So there you go, tyres are not happy. Definitely a good idea to put on traction control. Just have to be a bit smoother on corner entry now. We need to change this bad boy. Old Jorge's uh, closing in behind. We're going to have to be real careful on the hairpin. That's the tyre gone. Just have to hold it through the last couple of corners here. I knew it! I knew he'd do that! I knew it! He took P3 away from me. Ah, like now I can't turn around because I haven't got freaking handbrake. Last corner, well done. <laughs> Too early, Mr. Bus. P3 for you, that was going to be P3, maybe P2 for me, but we got dealt to on the last corner. The tyre just let go, and I was in his way, so he didn't mean to, but... That is what it is. That sucks. No! <laughs> Just managed to save it there. Go to cover the line. Car's out of shape again.
trying to desperately hold on. Yeah, he's so close. This is going to be a pretty obvious. He had nowhere to go. Break early. Yeah, he had nowhere to go. That was just unfortunate. Because I had no tyre left. Ah, uh, well. Have that in the big games. Yeah, watch this. The gap opens up, so that's fair game. And then the car's rotating, so I can't let him through, so to speak. And he's just got nowhere to go. Just hits me wide. I'm still turning, I'm under acceleration. So it's just going to let go. There we go, boom. Gone. If I go to my car, I'm already full lock. But, yeah, the tyre let go as well, you can see. So that's why that happened. So for next race, I think actually we're going to try TC1 a bit earlier. Yeah, a little bit really. I was probably holding him up that last couple of corners and that one I slid mid-corner. He had nowhere to go perhaps, but yeah, that ruined the race. It's a shame after all that effort last corner. <laughs> Never mind, that's what happens when you lose your tyres. Imaginary P2, yes! <laughs> oh, he definitely drove that well. 